Ryan and parishioner here at Sacred Heart, and welcome to On Fire. This is a daily gospel reflection. Today's reading is from the Gospel of John. Some in the crowd who heard these words of Jesus said, This is truly the prophet. Others said, This is the Christ. But others said, This Christ will not come from Galilee, will he? Does not scripture say that the Christ will be of David's family and come from Bethlehem, the village where David lived? So a division occurred in the crowd because of him. Some of them even wanted to arrest him, but no one laid hands on him. So the guards went to the chief priests and Pharisees who asked them, why did you not bring him? The guards answered, never before has anyone spoken like this man. So the Pharisees answered them, Have you also been deceived? Have any of the authorities or or Pharisees believed in him? But this crowd, which does not know the law, is accursed. Nicodemus, one of the members who had come to him earlier, said to them, Does our law condemn a man before it first hears him and finds out what he is doing? And they answered and said to him, You are not from Galilee also, are you? Look and see that no prophet arises from Galilee. Then each went to his own house. In this text, the Pharisees immediately rejected Jesus, thinking that they knew the truth, let alone God. Nicodemus, who met with Jesus just the other night, spoke up on his behalf, and no matter the outcome. You know, and ultimately in our lives, myself included, We judge and condemn the actions of others very harshly and rapidly. In a way, we too can act like the Pharisees, who immediately disapprove the actions of someone who is different. You know, if we take a second, uh, take a moment to stop and think, listening to our hearts, we may have a different outcome. At the same time, we're called to speak up for truth, no matter the consequences. It's gonna take some reflection to find that fine line between the two, So take some time in your life to monitor your thoughts and judgments on others and never let the moment pass for for you to change your opinions on, on someone if you feel that you've judged them too quickly. God bless you. And my eyes have truly been opened with this scripture. I hope it is done the same for you. Take care and have a great day.